Hey what's up guys then my offer simple snippets and I'm back with another video tutorial on quantitative aptitude. So in this video tutorial we learn a trick to calculate cube root of any number in seconds. So you don't need any calculator or any complex calculations to do that and in the matter of seconds you'll get the answer. So with that being said let's see how this trick works. Okay so as you can see on the screen I have written the cube values of 1 to 10. So these cube values of 1 to 10 are the only values that you need to know in order to know how to calculate values by this trick. So here I have written question 1 to 5. So let's see how this trick works with first question. So as you can see we have to find out the cube root of 35,937. So what we do is we first write down the number 35937. Now starting from the right to the left we make group of 3 values. So this would be one group and this would be the second with a 0 extra just for pairing purpose. So we've made group number 1 and group number 2 from right side. Now for the group number 1 we check the digits place. This is 7. Now we have to search that number in these cubes which has digits place as 7. So as you can see here we have 7. So the first number is 3. So this group corresponds to number 3. Now for the second group we have the number 35. So we need to find out the number in these cubes which is less than 35. So 27 is the closest number which is less than 35. So the second number again is 3. And there you go with the answer. Now if you calculate the cube of 3 you will get this answer. So let's see this trick again with question number 2. We are done with question number 1. So in question number 2 we have to find out the cube root of 30763. Now starting from the right we make group of 3. So this would be group number 1 and this is group number 2. For group number 1 we see the units place. In this case it is 3. So we need to find out a number with units place as 3. So this is 343. Three. Now 7 cube is 343. Three. So the first number is 7. So we write down 7 over here. Now for the second group we need to find out a number in these cubes which is less than 300 and is closest to the number 300. So the closest number which is less than 300 is 216. So 6 cube is 216. So the second number is 6. And there you go with the answer. So cube root of 300763 is 67. Now let's find out the cube root of the number 91125. 91125. So from the right I make groups of 3. So this would be first and this would be second with a 0 extra just for pairing purpose. So the units place of the first group is 5 and the number having units place 5 is 125 which is 5 cube. So the first number is 5. Now for the second group the number closest to 91 which is less than 91 is 64 that is 4 cube so the second number is 4 and there you go with the answer that is 45. So 45 cube will give you 91125. Now let's solve the fourth question wherein we have to find out the cube root of the number 970299. So I write the number first 970299. I make the groups starting from the right to left. So this is group 1 and this is group 2. For the first group at units place we have 9. So you find the number that has units place as 9 in these values which is 729. So it's 9 cube. So I write the number 9. Now for the second group I need to find a number which is less than 970 but is closest to the 970. So that number is 729. 729 is closest number to 970 which is less than 970. So the next number or the second digit is also 9. And there you go with the answer. So if you find cube of 99 you will get this number 970299. So now let's solve the last question which is pretty simple. So we have to find the cube root of 1331. So I make a group starting from right to left. This is the first group and there would be another group which is 001. For the first group we have 1 as the units place. So as you can see we have 1 at units place at this position or at this number. So 1 cube is equal to 1. So we have the first digit as 1. 
Now for the second group zero zero one, now the number closest equal to or less than one is one. So I just write down one over here, and this is our final answer. So eleven cube would give you this number that is one double three one. So that's it for this video, guys. I hope you understood this trick. So you can speed up your calculations during competitive aptitude exams. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you get notified when we upload the next video. Peace.